So, let's talk about how you can turn a 2D mission to a full 3D scene. We'll be using an app called TefSpy. Okay, go to official website and we need to download the app. Scroll down a bit and click here. Also grab the Blender add-on. Next, after you got it, open FSpy and wow, you will see some weird axes. But don't worry, you're about to fix the Start by adjusting the Y axis, just light up with the picture for your image. And next, uh, I like to change the X axis with that, cause for me it makes the position easier. Now, if everything looks upside down, just flip the Z axis, and uh, once it looks right, it's safe and let's drive the blender. Now, go to edit, preferences, add-ons, click install and select the web spy add-on. Make sure it's enabled. Now, when you are file, import, you'll see any option for web spy. Select it and load the file we just saved. So, your scene is already stuck with the correct camera perspective. Now, we just need to build the actual geometry. I usually start with the floor and then look out the basic shapes of the environment. Just keep it simple, no need for great details. Once everything is placed, select all the objects and press Ctrl plus J to make them into one. So, now let's add some textures. Add an image texture and here open the same image we're using FSPY and plug it into the base color of the material. Switch to edit mode by pressing tab, then hit 3 to select faces. Now press U and choose project from you. If it looks a little off, don't worry. Just add a subdivision surface modifier, switch it to simple mode, and crack up the wires a bit. Next I play with lightning. If I have to go crazy here, just adjust it until it looks good. Then I set up a simple camera animation to add more dynamic. And the final step, once the scene was looks solid, I rendered it and dropped it into After Effects for some quick color correction. And here's what I've done. 